What's up everyone? Taylor with Schofield Lawn Care here again uh, to review some stuff. Um, on the plate today is some boot and footwear reviews. Um, now that I've been in the game of lawn care for a while, I've tried. I've had a chance to try a bunch of different footwear. Um, I have tried Cujo shoes, Cujo boots. Uh, I've had a pair of Carhartt boots. I did, did cowboy boots, steel toe or composite toe and non-composite toe. Um, tennis shoes, I don't really like tennis shoes, but um, now I've had a chance, I've got some brunt boots that we're gonna talk about. Um, we'll have them for about a couple weeks. And I've got some Carhartt logging boots. Um, so yeah, into it in just one sec. So the two boots we gotta talk about is, this is a Carhartt logging boot, eight inch steel toe. Uh, picked these up last year, we'll talk about those. And then I've got this Brunt workwear, I think that's what it's called, Brunt boot. Um, I'm gonna try these out. So I've had, like I said, I've had Cujo shoes. Those lasted a while. Um, I had about two seasons out of those, kind of rotating them in and out. Uh, and then the backs wore out and they got uncomfortable. I had a pair of Cujo boots. They really didn't hold up that well. Um, the little vent in them like gave out and they were, they stunk really bad and I could not get the stink out, so I got rid of those. The last couple of years I've been using Justin's, their hybrid work boot, cowboy boot, composite toe, and they're waterproof. Those are really comfortable. Um, they just don't last. And now the first pair I bought, they were like 150, and then the second pair I bought, they were 175. And I just looked at them to get replaced on this a couple weeks ago. And they were a hundred, or they were $220. And I'm like, I'm gonna go spend $200 on boots that aren't gonna wear out. I'm gonna get something that's a little bit cheaper. I'm gonna go buy boots that aren't gonna be, that aren't gonna last. I'm just gonna get something cheaper. So with that, I bought these about the same time. Um, these logging boots, they, to quite honest, they suck. Like they got great traction, but they are uncomfortable. If I wear these all day, my feet throb. I only keep them around because I bought them. So I'm trying to get all my use out of them that I can. Um, the leather, they, they are waterproof. I've worn them in like a swamp. I've worn salting. As you can see, I've got salt stains and old salt on them. Like there's a, there's a tread pattern. Super deep. It's a, I believe it's a fully welted boot because it's got the stitching and everything. Um, it's just not very comfortable. They were super comfortable when I put them on, but as I wore them, this really hurt my foot where these ties are at. And just standing on on this all day, it just. Um, all right, so to the to the Bruntwear boots, um, I bought these off a of rec. I, I bought these; these were not sent to me, um, like some other people. Um, I bought these; these are one hundred forty five dollars. They're the Marin, I believe, composite toe, eight six inch boot. Um, so far, I've liked the only quorum I had was this little eyelet hole right there. Um, and like fishing around those, so I undid that. I don't do the, I don't use the little eyelets to cinch them up. I just run it through the holes. These have been pretty comfortable so far. I've had, like I said, about two weeks, just kind of wearing them around. I wore them snow plowing the other day um, and salting. Uh, so far they've been pretty comfy. There has been literally no breaking period. The only pain I've had, and it's just breaking the boot, is right here is pretty stiff when I'm driving and put my foot down, but we'll see how long they last. Um, I only usually get about six months out of a pair of boots from all the trimming and edging, and I use stand-on mowers, so I'm standing all day. So I gotta have something that's comfy. I wear pants because I, I don't know how guys can trim in shorts, so that's the reason why I don't like wearing cowboy boots, because I wanna wear shorts. You look a little hillbilly-ish with cowboy boots and shorts, and you get grass down on your feet. And then you get all pissy, at least I do. I don't like it. So, so far these are comfortable. We'll see how well they hold up. Um, just check for an update. We'll do an update about, or I'll do an update about um, probably June, June or July. Um, so I'll be in the thick of it in the season. We'll see how they hold up with the dew, wet grass, comfort standing all day on the grandstand. Um, so far just kicking it around. Um, They've been super comfy, but I, I don't know how long they'll last. So we'll have to see. Have a good one.